brilliant for a first effort. Mr. Bob Ashford has scored 81. Can you give him a round of applause? The, the second joke, which Daniel is going to, to recount for us, was submitted by Hannah and the Gun. And they submitted it because they would like to share the £100,000 between the poor, downtrodden workers of the world. <laughs> right, Daniel, let's hear it. Which chickens that lay electric eggs? I don't know which chickens lay electric eggs. Battery hens. <laughs>
Robert is in tire. Pet called Fred needs a flea. Can you see him on my hand there? Yes. Yes. Right. Now, lately in the room, we've been practicing some acrobatics to show you tonight, so we thought, right, that we'd do it now. Right. So then we're going to go from that hand to this hand.
A little girl had been to Sunday school for the first time and was asked by her mother how it compared with her day at school. Oh, I like it much better, she said. There are no exams there, and at the end you go to heaven instead of the high school. <laughs>
Oh, 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 oh,
I'm doing my best. <laughs> A one, 
day. So Ian rounds off his night by going out clubbing for a bit of a dapper.
<laughs> the angel Gabriel sent by God to a town in Galilee called Nazareth, to a virgin engaged to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David. The virgin's name was Mary, and he came to her and said, Greetings, favoured one, the Lord is with you. But she was much perplexed by his words and pondered what sort of greeting this might be. The angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favour with God, and now you will conceive in your womb a, ba a baby, a son, and you will name him Jesus. He will be great and will be called the Son of the Most High, and the Lord God will give to him the throne of his ancestor, David. You're going now to sing, Tell Out My Soul, The Greatness of the Lord, which is on your sheet. Towards the end of that hymn, I... on and after the birth of Jesus the angel announces the good news to the shepherd and this is going to be read by Frank Woolley our church walk. In that region there were shepherds living in the fields keeping watch over their flocks by night. Then an angel of the Lord stood before them and the glory of the Lord shone around them and they were terrified. But the angel said to them do not be afraid, for see, I am bringing you good news of great joy for all the people. To you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, who is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign for you. You will find a child wrapped in bands of cloth and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly host praising God and saying glory to God in the highest heaven and on earth peace among those whom he favors this is the good news to the wise men King Herod hears about this and fearing this may be a threat to him asks where the child is to be born this is to be read by Irene Winterbottom in the time of King Herod, after Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem, asking, Where is the child who has been born, King of the Jews? For we observed his star at its rising, and have come to pay him homage. When King Herod heard this, he was frightened, and all Jerusalem with him. And calling together all the chief priests and scribes of the people, he inquired of them where the Messiah was to be born. They told him, In Bethlehem of Judea, for so it has been written by the prophet. And you, Bethlehem, in the land of Judah, are by no means least among the rulers of Judah. For from you shall come a ruler, who is to shepherd my people Israel. Then Herod secretly called for the wise men and learned from them the exact time when the star had appeared. Then he sent them to Bethlehem, saying, Go and search diligently for the child, and when you have found him, bring me word, so that I may also go and pay him homage. God, you could have come with miracle and magic in a flash of light, in a hurricane of judgment, so that the earth shook and the universe trembled. But you chose to come in a baby's newborn cry. You chose to make your coming known to working men on a cold hillside, to wandering scholars, to an innkeeper and to the beasts of the field. Because you came a baby born to a young girl, you brought miracle and magic and mystery into ordinary things, and the whole creation sings at your coming 
and is blessed. In a major. This is read by John Wilcox, Chair of Governors of the School. In those days, the decree went out from the Emperor Augustus that all the world should be registered. This was the first registration and was taken while Quirinius was governor of Syria. All went down to their own towns to be registered. Aww. Joseph also went from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea, the city of David.
for the newborn child, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. And a warned in a dream not to return to the peril. This reading is read by Hilda Hallam, a member of our church's parochial church. When they heard the king, the wise men set out, and there ahead of them went the star that they had seen at its rises. And to the star, Thank you. 